be making moon dough or moon sand for you. First, we're gonna need some flour. You can use white flour. I'm using cassava flour. And you also need some oil. We can use olive oil, vegetable oil. I'm using corn oil. For the supplies, we're gonna need a measuring cup, some measuring spoons, and also some cookie cutters. You can also use some food coloring, but I don't have any right now, but that's okay. For the base, we are gonna be having a plastic container lid, or you can use a plastic tub or a plastic bin. First, I'm gonna be pouring in the flour inside the measuring cup. I'm gonna be pouring around 3 fourths of a cup. That's around 3 fourths. And I'm gonna pour it right on top of my plastic lid. You can shake it out if you'd like. And then we're gonna get our oil. So I already have poured out five tablespoons of vegetable oil, I mean corn oil. You can also take it with your tablespoon as well, but I'm just gonna pour it in since I already did five. And you're just gonna pour it right on top of the flour. Now you're gonna use your hands and this is the messy part. You're gonna use your hands to mix up all of that flour and all of that oil together. That's okay if it spills out or if it comes out. Mixing it all together. You can also add some more oil if you want it to be a little bit harder, or you can use less oil if you want it to be a little bit softer. So if you wanna use some cookie cutters like I have here, what I'm going to do is pat it down, press my cookie cutter inside, and lift up. So just like sand, you can also use a little cup or a big cup. I'm going to try to make a sand castle. So what I'm going to do is put in the moon sand or moon dough, turn it over, and voila! There we go. You can make several of these around. Just pat it inside the cup, turn it over. There we go, there's your moon sand.